Assalamu alaikum friends welcome to my channel MBBS and BDS lectures today our topic is related to general medicine iron deficiency anemia before going to topic of line if you want to watch the same topic in urdu hindi i already upload the same lecture in urdu hindi on my youtube channel go and watch that video but if you want to watch in english language then this video is for you now in last video we already studied anemia definition causes clinical feature classification in classification we studied microcytic anemia normocytic anemia macrocytic anemia in microcytic anemia we place three types of anemia we remember by mnemonic sit s i t sit down s i t s means sideroblast anemia i mean iron deficiency anemia or t mean thalassemia then we already said we will study each type of anemia in classification in detail like each type of anemia we study definition causes pathophysiology clinical feature investigation management now today i select one anemia from microcytic anemia iron deficiency anemia now in iron deficiency anemia our today topic outline is definition causes pathophysiology clinical feature investigation and management first we start from definition there is a very simple definition of iron deficiency anemia iron deficiency anemia is a microcytic anemia in which hemoglobin count become decrease why due to deficiency of iron simple definition iron deficiency anemia is a microcytic anemia in which hemoglobin count become decrease due to deficiency of iron this is the definition of iron deficiency anemia now come to the causes there are four causes of iron deficiency anemia number one is blood loss for example gi bleeding if blood loss occur from our body in result will be iron deficiency anemia mostly our professors our doctor ask in viva in bleeding which type of anemia occur our answer will be iron deficiency anemia number one cause is blood loss like gi bleeding number two is a poor diet poor diet mean iron deficient diet if we take iron deficient diet in the result there will be there will be iron deficiency anemia number third cause is inadequate absorption if there is a inadequate absorption again there will be iron deficiency anemia if normal absorption of iron not occur in the result will be iron deficiency anemia for example post gastrectomy like surgery of git and celiac disease mean autoimmune disease of git in these two condition there will be inadequate absorption of iron the fourth cause is increased requirement of iron if in our body requirement of iron become increase like in for example in growth pregnancy again will be iron deficiency anemia because iron is used other than rbc in other places like growth pregnancy these are the four causes of iron deficiency anemia now come to the pathophysiology in pathophysiology like we already studied in physiology erythropoiesis the process of formation of red blood cell erythropoiesis there are many stages in erythropoiesis before pro erythroblast stage there are many stages in which the stages before free erythroblast pro erythroblast they require erythropoietin hormone which is released from kidney but at pro erythroblast stage of erythropoiesis 
there will be iron required. If iron is present on proerythroblast stage, then after proerythroblast there will be early proerythroblast. After it, intermediate proerythroblast. Then late pro uh, uh, late erythroblast. Then nuclear ex extrusion, mean nucleus removed from cell. Then reticulocyte. And last, there will be RBC. But if iron is not present at proerythroblast stage, the next stages will not occur. Now, the, in pathophysiology, we simple one word. Iron is required at proerythroblast stage of erythropoiesis. If iron is not present after proerythroblast, the erythropoiesis will not occur and the result will be iron deficiency anemia. Now come to the clinical feature. There are 10 clinical features of iron deficiency anemia. Number one is pale skin. Number two, brittle nails. Number three, headache. Number four, fatigue. Number five, crack in the side of the mouth called angular stomatitis. Number six, faint or syncope in which there is a temporary loss of conscious. Seventh is dizziness. Eighth is chest pain. Ninth, glossitis mean inflammation of tongue. And the tenth is colonychia mean spoon-shaped nail. Now, we already studied clinical feature of anemia in last lecture. We studied 17 clinical feature of anemia in which we study the clinical feature of all anemia. But remember one thing, there are some clinical features which are common in each type of anemia. But there are some clinical features which are specific to specific anemia. Like, pale skin is common in all anemia, headache is common in all, fatigue is common in all, faints, dizziness, chest pain. But there are some specific clinical feature like iron deficiency anemia specific feature is colonic or spoon shaped nail is only specific is only specific clinical feature of iron deficiency anemia like glossitis crack in the side of the mouth angular stomatitis brittle nail these four are the characteristics specific feature of iron deficiency anemia number one colonic number two glossitis number three Crack in the side of the mouth, angular stomatitis, and number uh, second, uh, number fourth is brittle nails. These are the clinical feature of iron deficiency anemia. Now come to the investigation. We do basically two investigation per iron deficiency anemia. Number one is CBC. Number two is blood film. In CBC, when we do CBC, the platelets count will be normal. WBC will be normal, but the mean corpuscular volume of RVC will be small, less than 83, and the result will be, which show microcytic anemia. Number two, we do blood film. Blood film like, we take a slide and put the blood on the slide, and after that, the slide show a cell. In blood film, there will be hypochromic cells. Hypochromic cell means pale cell, pale color cell, which show decrease hemoglobin concentration. Because if hemoglobin is more, the cell will be normochromic, normal color means red color. But hypochromic show, hypochromic pale cell show less hemoglobin, less hemoglobin. There is another classification, we study uh, first classification of anemia like on the basis of cell size, normocytic, uh, uh, microcytic, macrocytic, but another classification on the, on the basis of color, <clears throat> uh, on the basis of color like hypochromic, normochromic. Now, iron deficiency anemia is microcytic and hypochromic anemia. If these two things are proved by CBC and blood film. CBC show microcytic and blood film show hypochromic. There will be 
can form iron deficiency anemia these are the two investigation now come to the management and management we give oral iron supplement now today we studied definition causes pathophysiology clinical feature investigation and management of anemia today our topic is complete if you like my videos press the like button and share my videos with your friends and if you new to my channel subscribe my channel for more videos and press the bell icon and select the all notification in order to you receive my all new video notification for watching my videos i am very thankful to you thank you very much